In this video, we introduce Sequence Surveyor, a scalable whole genome alignment overview visualization tool capable of supporting the analysis of over 100 genomes simultaneously. Sequence Surveyor employs a variety of color and position mappings to support the exploration of a wide range of questions about the data. This video will highlight a few of these mappings. Sequence Surveyor uses gene-level alignment data. Genomes are displayed as bars. Many orderings of the genes within the genome are available. Here, genes are ordered by their position in each genome, beginning to the left and end to the right. Each row is grouped into blocks that contain many genes. The contents of the currently selected block are shown in the zoom window at the top of the ordering. When a block is moused over, other blocks with genes that match it are highlighted. Mousing over a gene in the zoom window also highlights blocks that contain that gene. Genes can be colored according to various properties. Here, genes are colored according to their frequency. Blocks aggregate the colors of the genes they contain. Sequence Surveyor supports four aggregation schemes. Averaging, robust averaging, which shows dominant trends in the data, event striping that emphasizes outliers, and color weaving that conveys distributions. The evolutionary tree associated with the genomes is displayed left in the phylogenetic tree. The histogram in the lower left conveys the overall distribution of gene frequency values in the data set. The color mapping values are shown in the color scale window above the histogram. Here we apply sequence surveyor to a data set of 14 plant pathogen bacteria. This view colors by membership frequency. Genes that occur in many genomes are colored red. Genes that occur in a single genome are colored blue. This coloring allows us to quickly identify core genes that are common and unique genes that may differentiate species. Here, we have reordered the genes by frequency. More common genes are moved to the left, less common ones are on the right. This view emphasizes which genes are shared among subsets of the genomes. It shows information independent of the physical location of the gene. Here, we again reorder the genes, this time based on their position in a selected reference genome, indicated by the pink box. This allows for a quick comparison with the reference, highlighting both unique features, colored in blue, and more common features, colored in red. Changing aggregation schemes highlights different aspects of this data. Here, robust averaging emphasizes trends. Event striping emphasizes more unique features in the data. Here, we return to sorting by the position in each genome and color by the position in the selected reference. Genes occurring in the reference are assigned warm colors, red if they're at the beginning and yellow at the end. Genes not in the reference are colored gray. Color weaving is used to convey gene distributions. This view shows shared regions and the preservation and inversion of ordering by the preservations and inversions of regions of the reference color ramp. Sequence Surveyor generalizes these techniques to support the simultaneous exploration of over 100 genomes.